Welcome back, baseball fans, to another episode of Touch Em All, brought to you by Sports Not. I'm your host, Scott Branson, and we got a packed show with some of the hottest stories from around the Major League Diamond. Let's dive right into the action and touch all the bases of this week's major stories. First up, it's a story that's been taking headlines by Storm Shohei Hotani's former translator, Ipe Masahura, faces serious charges. He's accused of bank fraud, allegedly transferring over $16 million from Otani's accounts to pay off gambling debts. Major League Baseball has stated that Otani is a victim here with no evidence of him authorizing the transfers or betting on the sport. Mitsuhara, dismissed by the Dodgers, is set to appear in court soon, a reminder of how off-field issues can shockingly impact the lives of our favorite athletes. Shifting gears now to a more uplifting story, let's talk about the beginning of the Jackson holiday era in Baltimore. The Orioles rookie may have had a quiet start at the plate during his debut at Fenway Park, but he did notch an RBI. Despite going 0 for 4, Holiday's enthusiasm and readiness to compete at the highest level were crystal clear. It's just the beginning for this young star, and Orioles fans, you'll want to keep an eye out on this kid. I can't wait to watch him some more. Next, we take a moment to remember the beloved figures of the Boston community, Tim and Stacy Wakefield, the emotional ceremonial first pitch by their daughter, Brianna, at Fenway Park was a heartwarming tribute to the couple. Both pillars of charity and kindness in the Boston area, both lost to cancer within months of each other. It was a touching day filled with memories and support, reminding us all of the human element so prevalent in the sport we love. In contract news, the same Boston Red Sox have locked in outfielder Sedane Raphael, an impressive eight-year, $50 million deal. Despite limited time, Raphael's defensive prowess and potential growth at the plate convinced the Sox he's worth the long-term investment. It's a life-changing moment for Raphaela and a big bet on his future contributions on and off the field for the Wicked Sox. And finally, wrapping up the players of the week this week in Major League Baseball, Ronel Blanco of the Houston Astros and Spencer Steer of the Reds. Blanco tossed the 17th no-hitter in Astros history and has shown incredible form early this season, while Steer's power at the plate has been turning heads with multiple homers and a grand slam that secured a victory for the Reds. Congratulations to both on their outstanding performances. All right, there you have it. That's our weekly baseball roundup here on Touch Em All. Whether it's jaw-dropping plays or stories that tug at your heartstrings, baseball never fails to deliver. I'm Scott Branson, and I'll see you next week for more updates. Until then, keep your cleats dirty and your dreams big.